it has it is has it is it's it's been a long time I've been a recording a video. Well that jumping Mario video I made I made it a little bit. Um, sorry guys, just need to pause this for a moment. Okay guys, so that we're going to have to make our iPad or iPhone or Google TV. My name is Quiet Charger right now, but I can show you a quick, but I can show you a quick look if you want. So, here is the, the lock screen. So, yeah, here's the lock screen. And asking for my touch ID, I scan it, still recognize it, and it has this look. All the icons are changed. So we're going to show you how to do that. So, so um, let me, so my, um, so let me just scan my iPad, and let me see, and let me see if I have a phone. There could be some hidden phone around here, but I don't know. It doesn't matter whatever it takes, but I'll do I'll try to do my best. So can I pause this for a moment? Yes, please. Oh oops. <coughs> okay, let me just pause. For real! For real! So here I got my mom's phone. Well, it's not my mom's phone, but it's my mom's work phone. She is mostly a Samsung user. Anyway, open your phone and you want to go. Just open your phone. Get your phone and you want to go to settings and you want to go. I know it's quite a little bright. I'm going to reduce the brightness because I don't want to show my hands. Then, uh, so open settings, then go to accessibility, then go to, and you should be upgraded to iOS 7 or, or iOS 14 or 15 to do this. So if you're on iOS 7, then go to general, then you want to go to accessibility. But since this is iOS 14, go to accessibility. Then you want to go to spoken content. Content. I mean, I mean, don't go to spoken content. I am sorry for that. Um, I don't remember where it was. Then go to motion and then reduce motion. This will reduce motion when, and it'll show some kind of fade animation. So enable that first and. And then also, and and then also, you want to go to Safari, and you want to go to iScan. Now this is seriously important. Do not use a. You can you cannot use a third party browser like Google Chrome or Microsoft Edge to do this. Otherwise, it will not work. Only use this. The browser made by Apple itself, so you won't have any issues. And of course, you could install it. So, so open Safari. Then you want to search for iSkin. Click on there. Then go. Then go where it has. Then don't choose the the hard one. You want to go where it says where it says make and install iOS themes on your iPhone and iPad without jailbreak. Open iScan. Then you want to go to themes. Just close the ad if it shows you one. So close one. Then you want to go where it says theme D. Windows 98, go there. And then you want to scroll down and choose home screen. So on your home screen, if you're running an iPad, you want to choose made for iPad 2 and iPad mini landscape. 
If you're on iPhone and then you have to go to me for iPhone 6, then save that in your photos. If you don't know, if you don't know how to save it, just hold the photo, then, then, then press add to photos and then it'll be saved. Do it the same for the lottery. Next, you want to go and add applications. So, pick the applications that you have. Um, Apple App Store, Apple Music, whatever you have. And then, and then once you're done, and once you're done, then, then you should press generate theme. Okay. Then, then once you press generate theme, then, then you, then just wait until it shows you with a message. Press allow, then go to, then go to, then just close it, it, whatever the error is, then go to settings, and then you want to go to profile, download it, enter your password if you don't have one, and then you'll just get the prompts, then, then, how am I supposed to say that? Then press install, then press the red button, install, could be serious, but, but you have to do it. Then once it's done, then then you'll have all your icons. Then also you want to change the wallpaper. Go to settings or photos. On on settings, go to settings wallpaper. You want to go to settings. You want to go to settings wallpaper. And you want to choose. And you want to. Okay, I'm not going to show you this. Then you want to go to all photos and then select the home screen and the lock screen. Set the home screen to home screen and set the start the, the lock screen to lock screen. And this will give you a very clean look. Also, also you want to also you want to put the recycle bin. If you have Files downloaded, you're in luck. Then you have to go to shortcuts. Then you want to go to shortcuts. Add action. You want to go to add action. Then, then go to scripting. Open app. And then press choose or app. Then choose, then choose files, then, then click the three dots, add to home screen, and you want to change the icon, then you want to choose photo, and choose the photo you did it. Then you want to call this recycle bin, add to your home screen, it will do the shortcut. So add, add it to your home screen, press done then, next. Then just press whatever, just press, and it'll be added to your home screen. So, hope you enjoyed this video. It helped you turn your 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 iOS device into into something amazing. Please, I want you to I want you to like or dislike my videos. Whatever. Goodbye and have a great day.